Hey, what's up, everybody? It's your boy Harsh here. How you doing? I'm not doing fine. I, I've been sick. It's been four days. That's why I haven't uploaded a video. And yes, so PS5 Pro is next month, seventh. We're gonna talk about it more. But how much games are coming on PS5? Let's see. Let's see how much games are coming on PS5, and let's talk about why PS5 might be. Why PS5 gonna be? good I mean not good it's totally over expensive it's $800 without disc or anything so it's expensive and they don't provide exclusive games there's nothing new not even a big update like PS5 from PS4 is a big update but PS5 from PS5 Pro is not a big update so we might see like PS6 the next few years but GTA 6 that's the deal like P GTA 6 already promised that's gonna come on PS5 and there are some rumors on the internet that PS5 Pro cannot handle GTA 6 not in 60 FPS not in 4k 60 you know what I mean I, I, I think you can run it on 60 FPS 1080p it's not gonna be that big don't uh, think it like that's just a video game so it might run on 1080p 60 which is fine for me I'm probably gonna play it on 1080p 60 and probably gonna stream so subscribe our channel who we're gonna stream whenever GTA 6 is out we all know that Sony is gonna market GTA 6 as we have in the partnership deals of Rockstar we had the leaks everything so Sony is gonna do the marketing of GTA 6 and Sony owns PlayStation so it's definitely gonna market PS5 Pro to as a better console to run G GTA 6 and they're probably gonna label it as you know this PS5 Pro can run GTA 6 on 60 FPS, if not 60, then 40, 45, 50, and 4K. <laughs> Let's not talk about 8K. That's gonna be false. <laughs> so, yeah, that's gonna be. And if you have PS5, and if you're planning to buy PS5, I would not recommend that. I have seen some people on the internet that they're buying PS5 for GTA 6. I would not recommend. I would just recommend that you, you should wait. You know add some more money and buy a ps5 pro i mean it's definitely gonna run better than ps5 okay yeah it's expensive it's not a big upgrade anything and i'm i, I didn't get paid by playstation don't tell me that I'm, I'm doing promotion or anything no i just think that if you have the money for ps5 why not just wait you know three four months and add some extra money and buy ps5 pro so that you can have more graphical upgrade i mean something is better than nothing okay so if ps5 pro is gonna run 10 percent better it's 10 percent better and it might run gta 5 on 50 fps which is which is better than 30 fps so yeah if you have bought ps5 don't buy ps5 pro just stuck with it play gta 6 on 30 fps Play GTA 6 on 1080p, that will run in 60fps. But yeah, that's what I wanted to say. But if you're planning to buy like me, I would wait. I would wait like 3, 4, 5 months. Then buy a PS5 Pro whenever GTA 6 come out. Probably next year, October to September. Hopefully, you know, fingers crossed. So yeah, this video is that's all about it. And I want to show you something. I want to show you something strange on the internet, so let's watch it. So I found this on the internet. There are 21 games which are releasing uh, on PS5 Pro. Let's see which one of them are. It's actually going to be so important. So we're in the, this website, Game Rant. Uh, okay. So Alan Wake 2 is already out. Assassin's Creed Shadows. Okay. It's definitely not going to be P PS5 Pro exclusive. Definitely not. F124, maybe. Hogwarts Legacy, it's already out there. So, it looks like there's no new game is specifically coming for PS5 Pro, which gave us a lot of questions that there's only one game that can save PS5 Pro. And you know it. That's GTA 6. And why I say that? Well, it's it's simple you know it's simple you have to get it that G GTA 6 is gonna be so 
like there is rumor that you know i'm just gonna search it so i can show you that there is rumor that gta 6 might not run as you can see expectation for gta 6 running on 60 fps on current consoles may not be met due to hardware limitations so there's only thing the ps5 pro rockstar game may have target 30 fps for gta 6 on ps5 pro and adjust player expectation accordingly well that's the thing no player is gonna play a game at 30 fps it's insane so they might be like you can run it on 1080p on 60 fps but 4k on 60 fps interestingly as you know the ps5 pro is coming on november 7th and what's interesting is that so here we are it's updated and it's happening on november 7 okay and ps5 pro is releasing on november 7th not too long it's probably gonna be 15 to 20 days i'm saying more so it's insane that people are not attaching the strings it's simple that they're gonna release or maybe give a statement that gta 6 is gonna run better on ps5 pro that's why people are gonna buy it and you know i i think that's enough for ps5 pro one game yep if that game is gta 6 the one game is enough and it's gonna run it's gonna run good I mean not 60 then 40 45 FPS on 4k people are gonna buy that and I think this is gonna be the best-selling console ever that's the hype that's the hype of GTA 6 you don't understand it it's insane that people not getting it so this is for me it's so so simple that November 7th and November 7th there has to be something and we might see the GTA 6 second trailer you know people are expecting it that might come on 7 september i'm probably gonna live stream i'm probably gonna live stream that would be way better thing to do that day so yeah i'm gonna buy it not this november but whenever gta 6 is gonna come i'm gonna play it i'm gonna stream subscribe to that channel we're gonna stream in this channel we're gonna be more and yeah let's quit let's stop the yapping i hope you like the video thank you so much for watching subscribe see you bye